Let's consider this question. This is a rational limit function with square root at the numerator. But the square root at the numerator does not extend to minus 4. The first step is let's apply direct substitution that is plug in to the function. That is wherever we see x we are going to substitute 9 and we got 0 over 0 which is indeterminate. Next step number 2 rationalize the numerator by conjugate. That is, I'm going to multiply both the numerator and the denominator by everything at the numerator. However, I'm going to change the arithmetic operator sign that separates them. This means, instead of this minus, I'm going to have a plus for the conjugate. Remember, everything at the top will be multiplying and everything at the denominator will also be multiplying. Before we go to the next step, let's recap. From laws of indices, square root of a multiplies square root of a. It is the same thing as a to the power of half multiply a to the power of half which is the same as a to the power of this half we add to this half and 1 over 2 plus 1 over 2 is 1 which is the same thing as a you can see because these two a's are the same it's going to return just one of it considering the square roots that both of them have Likewise, A can be anything. Here, A can represent X plus 7. And from the law of indices, it returned X plus 7. We are going to apply this to the function. Hence, this function becomes this function. That is, square root of X plus 7 multiply square root of x plus 7 we give us x plus 7 next square root of x plus 7 we multiply 4 and we're going to have 4 multiply square root of x plus 7 this is done next is the minus 4 minus 4 multiply square root of x plus 7 and we're going to have minus 4 square root of x plus 7 next minus 4 multiply plus 4 and we're going to have minus 16 next at the denominator x plus 9 we multiply everything on this side and we bring them together next 4 multiply the square root of x plus 7 will cancel out 4 minus 4 multiply x plus 7 square root. Next, we are left with this function. Next, this, we take away this. Next, we take the limit of the remaining function. That is, wherever I see x, I will now input 9. And 9 plus 7 will give you 16 and our answer is 1 over 8 and from the options our answer is b and check out for other videos in precalculus and to locate these videos you can follow the link on the screen i will see you in the next video